Hey, so here I am back again in the ER. Um, I had to come because um, I, for a week I've had diarrhea um, and vomiting, even with liquids. Um, and my palliative nurse said, just go to the ER. Um, she had actually said that a couple days ago and I was like, no, I don't wanna go. Um, but it got worse. So I came. Um, I've been extremely weak um, from not being able to eat much. I got two bags of fluids going right now. Um, I think they said that my blood, I don't know, I think I have to ask you about my blood results, but um, I don't know what the plan is just yet. So I'll update more when I know. Um, I just wanted to update because it's been a few hours, well more than a few hours since I last updated. Um, they have me in the ICU for observation um, and uh, that's currently where I'm at. I was puking all night. Um, every sip of water I would throw up within seconds. Um, same with my ice water. Just kept coming back up. Uh, so yeah, here I am. And luckily I have a nice big room uh, with a window. Um, getting my fluids. Um, and yeah, I am really foggy right now. I can't think straight because I haven't been eating much these days uh, since I've been so sick with the diarrhea and the vomiting um, constantly. It's taken so much out of me. It's it's just been detrimental as far as my energy levels and everything. It's affected my pots and my heart, my breathing. Everything has been worse. Uh, luckily, my blood counts aren't too bad, but they did um, put me on an antibiotic in case I have like an infection. They're still waiting on a stool sample, which I haven't been able to give. Um, ironically, since I've been in the hospital, I haven't run to the bathroom with diarrhea. Um, which I'm thankful about. Oh, it's a little break. Um, but yeah, that's my update for now. Um, my niece is here. She's um, visiting and I haven't seen her for a while. So I'm going to hang out with her for a little bit and I'll try to update later. Yeah, that black chef with kind of hot, but like... Wait, bamboozled? Yeah, Bamboo like, what does that even mean again? I don't know. It's just bamboozled. I, 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 I do not, I have, like, I want them far away from me, I, like, I cannot, they, like, just fuck me over, <laughs> literally, and maybe figuratively. <laughs> and not this in is good becoming way. Not extra the way, way oh, Not the way you want to be fucked over. <laughs> Holy, oh, so fucked over and dick me down are two different things. Good taste. Oh, okay. The truth is, I'm a lady, you are... I like gifts, I like going out, I like Miami, but you will not get sex from me. So if you're looking for that, you're barking up the goddamn wrong tree. I like Miami. So these guys will Preach, like girl. And like those are my nieces, everybody. <laughs> Good morning. Getting my little stretch in. Had a good night of sleep, which I'm thankful for. Since that's hard to come by in the hospital. Taking my morning meds. I don't take all of the meds I take at home in the hospital, but I take most of them. Plus, you know, more. <laughs> Here I am brushing my teeth. Oral hygiene is just as important as the rest of your body's health. I have to remind myself of this sometimes, if I'm being honest. And washing my face with some soap.
Pissing it off. And I am good to go. Hey guys, a uh, quick update. Um, I've been moved from the ICU to the telemetry unit. Telemetry. <laughs> Um, and I had a CT scan of my abdomen done uh, last night, which was clear. Um, and let's see, I unfortunately am still having um, frequent diarrhea. Sorry, TMI, but um, I've gone I think nine times in the last 24 hours. Um, <laughs> sorry, again, if that's too much information, then continue on to another channel um, but yeah I so that's that's been pretty rough I've also had a couple bouts of vomiting today in the, in the morning oh, so I'm exhausted um, and I met with a GI and we talked about having a colonoscopy in the morning um, so it should be tomorrow morning it should be scheduled for tomorrow morning um, I am currently drinking the delicious bowel prep as you can see here um, and what else uh, depending on the results of the colonoscopy uh, I will I may have a gastric emptying study done um, and then depending on those results we will discuss TPN um, in further detail um, and yeah that's pretty much all I have to update with now so I'll see you guys later. So um, since the last time I checked in, I have had my colonoscopy. Um, it went okay, all things considered. Uh, I didn't get any sleep last night, um, none at all. Um, <laughs> that's hospital life, right? Uh, so I had the colonoscopy and it was so far so clear. Um, they're still waiting on something, a biopsy or something, I'm not sure. Um, so I'm extremely weak, still on clear liquids only, but at least I'm tolerating that okay, which is a step up from yesterday, so that's really good. Um, and yeah, we're just kind of taking it slowly from here, see, seeing how I do on the clear liquid liquids for a little longer. Um, if I do okay with those a little longer, I'll, I'll try some like applesauce um, and see how I do with that. So yeah, that's my little check-in now. Hi hey everyone, uh, I am being discharged, uh, jailbreak. Um, so I was able to hold down some applesauce and so they basically said I'm good to go since I was able to hold that down. Um, with Toradol and like a, a weird concoction that they gave me of um, viscous lidocaine, uh, potassium, and Maalox, I believe it was, which was really interesting. It was like numbing and all weird, but it, it did help a little bit. Um, and then the Toradol helped also. And Compazine. Um, so yeah, I'm going to be going home soon. And right now, my the next thing is getting a gastric emptying study um, to uh, confirm the gastroparesis. And then the second thing is figure out the infusions. That's like the big thing right now is um, it's been a big mess with insurance. Um, long story short, I've called a billion different infusion companies and none of them is willing to work with me based on uh, my insurance, which is Medicaid. Um, Aetna Better Health of Virginia is the plan I have. Um, and none of them have been willing to um, accept me as a patient. So that's my next um, goal, I guess, or challenge is to figure that out. Um, and yeah, that's basically the update I have for now, so I'll see you guys later. Bye!